Ask any longtime resident what gives Lancaster, California its innovative edge, and they'll point to the city's rich aerospace technology heritage. A heritage which includes testing of the B-2 stealth bomber, the F-117A stealth fighter, the SR-71 Blackbird, and the U-2. In fact, it's not uncommon to look into Lancaster's clear blue sky and see one, two, or even three of these beautiful aircraft flying at the same time. Given this strong heritage, it's easy to appreciate the latest advancements the city has made in technological and lifestyle innovations, including going green at the new solar energy plant developed by eSolar. This new solar energy plant incorporates eSolar's unique modular and scalable solution to deliver cost-competitive solar energy in response to ever-increasing worldwide energy demands. Demands which include a recently announced power purchase agreement with Southern California Edison to produce 245 megawatts of solar thermal power. The e-solar power plant utilizes small mirrors, or heliostats, which track the sun with high precision and reflect the sunlight to a tower-mounted thermal receiver. The focused heat boils water in the thermal receiver, producing enough steam to power a traditional turbine and generate solar electricity. Once complete, this site will utilize 24,000 heliostats. The new solar field layout minimizes installation time and cost. Minimal skilled labor is required to build the solar field, allowing for greater efficiencies. eSolar regards Lancaster as an emerging hub in the green energy sector. This Sierra demonstration facility will deliver 5 megawatts of clean, renewable electricity to the grid, enough to power about 5,000 homes. This will be eSolar's flagship location, complete with a visitor center to introduce this cutting-edge technology to business prospects from around the world. The center will welcome foreign dignitaries and educate future generations about renewable energy, solar power, and specifically solar thermal solutions. Once complete, the Sierra Demonstration Facility will be the first operating solar power tower plant in the nation and only the second in the world. Technological innovations are just some of the changes taking place throughout the city. Another innovative and fun development, which has become quite a tourist attraction, is the nation's first and only musical road, located right here in Lancaster. <laughs> The musical road was initially installed as part of a Honda Motor Company marketing campaign designed to play the William Tell Overture when driven upon. Whoa, this is awesome. The original road was repaved shortly after the commercial was shot due to traffic concerns arising out of its immediate overwhelming popularity. But then the unexpected happened. The road reappeared, this time constructed by the city, a full two miles from the nearest residence. Well, some friends of ours in L.A. told us about this musical road up here in Lancaster. And we decided to come check it out. It was amazing. The technology is incredible. It was cool. Let's go again. Yeah. Okay. So, once again, the musical road is attracting new visitors to Lancaster. Not only is the road fun and entertaining, but it's a unique engineering feat, bringing a new source of pride to the community. Another seamless marriage between technology and lifestyle design can be found here at Lancaster's Arbor Court. A more than 300-unit facility located within Lancaster's downtown area, Arbor Court defines a new standard for senior housing. The recent transformation of the popular 50,000 square foot Essex House Hotel by the Insight Development and Housing Corporation of America has resulted in a campus offering a variety of impressive amenities at a monthly cost affordable to most seniors. One such amenity is eCourt, which incorporates a 90 station touchscreen learning environment. Here, residents engage in brain games such as Scrabble, Sudoku, and puzzles, activities which are proven to keep mature minds sharp and active, and all while having a ton of fun. The complex also houses a 10,000 square foot healthcare facility, offering occupational therapy, speech therapy, and other rehabilitation options. We wanted to keep it affordable to people who are um, 
who are on fixed income. So for $800 a month, we wanted to create a place that will provide everything that they need to survive, to live, including food. Arbor Court also provides an arts and crafts room, sewing and quilt room, and fully equipped pottery room. We wanted to create a place that seniors don't have to leave. Part of the community concept includes Arbor Court Mall. Here, seniors will have a supermarket, discount hair salon, massage parlor, coffee and juice bar, as well as access to AV Bridge Club. We're going to open up a shop that they will be able to sell their sewing stuff and their pottery and different Christmas items that we're going to create, all of it going back to self-sustain this property so we don't have to charge anymore. We're going to have a garden. And our garden, um, the Chamber of Commerce is, is supporting and they've given us a donation. Lancaster's progressive approach to changing the fabric of its community continues with current designs to renovate the downtown area with restaurants, businesses, public parks, and facilities. Such renovations include artist lofts and a new lifestyle restaurant where patrons can socialize between tables using state-of-the-art touchscreen technology. Once complete, these new artist lofts will offer an affordable work-live environment for artists, ushering in a new era of downtown arts and culture. This 21-unit loft complex will bring a unique urban space to the downtown area. Each 1,600-square-foot, two-story unit will have four bedrooms, two bathrooms, and a common kitchen area. There will also be 2,000 square feet of indoor-outdoor gallery space for local artists to proudly display their works. These developments are all just part of the new wave of growth here in Lancaster. So, just as Lancaster continues to be a pivotal player in the aerospace industry, it is also transforming itself into a leader in the latest technological and lifestyle innovations. The economic security that these different industries are bringing into the valley are going to be truly revolutionary. Right now we have thousands of people having to drive down to Los Angeles and drive back every day three, four, sometimes five hours a day on the road just to support their families. In a short period of time, and what I mean by that is four or five years, we will have the industry in place here and it's non-polluting industry that will be able to provide those people with the jobs right here. Look at the quality of life change that's going to create. We are on the tip of a wave that is going to ride us into or drive us into economic security very quickly.